a visit with Master Wan Su Jian of Bagua Shundao Gong. The day after our visit with Master Wu, we went to visit another uh, quite famous Qigong master named Master Wan, and his style is Bagua Shundao Gong. And what a contrast there was. Um, whereas with Master Wu, we just visited him uh, inside his, his home, his small flat. Um, with Master Wan, we visited him at his complex. Uh, and so there were big gates to drive through as we came in. And as we came in, we were welcomed with banging of drums and uh, clashing of cymbals uh, and with all of his, uh, some of his staff who were on site uh, to welcome us. Um, again, we had some speeches, some presentations. Uh, I, along with others from the New Zealand Qigong and Traditional Chinese Medicine Association, presented Master Wan with a banner uh, in recognition of our, I guess, our ongoing friendship because previously Master Wan had visited New Zealand and now we were visiting him in China. So that was really nice. We also went on a tour of his complex, uh, which has many different parts to it. Um, it has meeting rooms, it has a dining room, which I think I've got a shot of that I'll put in later. Um, but then it has rooms for different types of meditation. It has, uh, and, and I will mention, so Master Wan's, whereas Master Wu's Qigong was a Buddhist type of Qigong, Master Wan's is quite specifically a Taoist type of Qigong. And so there were different rooms that were dedicated to different aspects of Taoism. And then he has many treatment rooms uh, for, for people who come from all over the world and also within China uh, to receive Qigong treatment at his facility. And he even has some residential rooms where people can stay if they have come from far away and they're needing to stay and spend a longer period of time at his center. All of the decorations were really impressive, really nice. Lots of uh, statues, lots of murals and images on the walls, which were really cool. I think I've got a fair few shots of those that I will, uh, I will put in here, um, you know, while I talk about different things. Now, one of the things that was really interesting as well is we were privileged to take part in a Taoist ceremony with Master One, and uh, this particular ceremony, it's, uh, it's to connect, basically connect to the energy of heaven, and the only place in Beijing that you can, that this ceremony takes place is with Master One, within his complex, or at the White Cloud Temple, which is a Taoist temple in Beijing, um, which I have visited previously, but uh, not on this trip. And so that was really interesting to observe and to participate in this Taoist uh, ceremony uh, as, as, as part of what we did with Master One. A few things that were interesting about spending time with Master One um, was that it really stood out to me how uh, both for him and Master Wu, uh, they had a, a very clear and strong connection to religion within their Qigong practice. Uh, of course, a large part of our group um, practicing the Tianchuan Qigong, which, which is a Buddhist type of Qigong. Uh, the, you know, one of, uh, Sunny, who is, who's uh, in our group, and um, she was very careful to explain to everyone several times while we were with Master Wan that uh, his way of doing things was different from the way that they do things in Tianchuan Qigong. That it was still good, but it was different. It was a Taoist way, not a Buddhist way. And it was, you know, so she was very careful to explain that to them several times so that they wouldn't get confused about that. Whereas I personally would be very careful to explain that you don't have to mix religion with Qigong. Um, but it was interesting to see just how strongly they connected, you know, each of these two very different masters connected their practice to, to religion. 
So a very interesting, very cool visit. Cool to spend some time with Master Wan and to see his facility and to um, gain more of an appreciation of the Taoist nature of his Qigong. Uh, we'll be seeing more of Master Wan late, later on because he is going to be going to the, the medical Qigong conference that we're attending in um, just a few days now. So uh, yeah, I, I hope you enjoyed having a look around Master One's facility with me um, and I look forward to seeing you on the next one.